But I want to uh, take our time right quick. This is very important. I want to take our time to pay homage to my outfit. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, take a little time. Huh? Yes, you see it well. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I have been on tour, like she said, with Nephew Time from the Steve Harvey show. So, you know, that nigga got money. So a nigga done got a little bougie and shit, you know. So I done started stopping at design stores and, you know, places where, you know, it's a little uppity. You know, who's your nigga shop? I know it's a couple niggas in there look like they got a little money. Look like y'all shop at some of the little designer stores I shop at, so. If you are fortunate to shop at some of the stores I shop at, you probably heard of uh, one of them named uh, Marshalls. <laughs> uh, where I get a lot of my exclusive designer pants from uh, Rose, say. Right, and where I get a lot of my tailor-made suit set, I go to Berlanti. <laughs> Coach Victoria. I don't know if y'all ever heard of any of these designer places, but that's where I go to get my linens and things. And if anybody been fortunate to be able to afford to shop at these designer places, you know it's not about what the price is, but what about the price was. It's about the goddamn deal that you got in that motherfucker. You get what I'm saying? Like, for instance, this shirt. I went into Marshall's. And you know, you gotta have, you gotta have time and patience in Marshall's, cause you really gotta look through the goddamn, you know, you got to really look through that shit, cause you know, if you like me, you might hide some shit that, you know, well not hide it, but maybe replace it. Cause I found this shirt in Junior's, so. You know, you can't buy it today, you know, motherfuckers. Will. I put some shit over there in big coats in a minute and tuck it in some shit. So, you know, I found this shirt and it was originally $39.99. But being a Marshalls member that I am, I got it for the discounted tag price at $10.99. Okay, you can clap it up for that, yeah. Yeah, Mama Tower and Well. Now, if you was ever fortunate to shop at these boutique stores, you know that you can't get your whole fit in one store. That's why they put Rose right next door to Marshall, so you can just walk out and walk in there and finish your next unit. Now, if you know about Rose, you know it don't ever look like a motherfucker working at Rose. It just look like shit everywhere all the damn time. The only thing gonna do this is the security guard. He the only motherfucker visible at the front door. Other than that, you is on your damn arm. But anyway, I went in there looking for me some pants. And now I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I don't steal. But I do take blessings God bestowed upon me in certain situations that he lay upon my feet. So y'all know them little red stickers that be on some of the tags and stuff. What you call that? The, uh, the clearance. Okay, we'll call it clearance then. Uh, now, nah, like I told you, I don't steal. No, I didn't go in there and peel the goddamn sticker off. I'm not no goddamn heathen, but on this particular day, with these particular pants, it was two pair like these, but it was a slight difference in them, but they was real similar. But the only difference was the other pair of pants had that little red sticker on it. No, I didn't peel it off, but the blessing that was put upon me, somebody obviously got caught before me, me and Peel, because it was kind of hanging off a little bit. And I said, well, look at this sticker hanging out. So I really wanted to see, well, what's the difference in the pants? Because they look so similar. So I hold it up to the sky to see. And lo and behold, I dropped the pants. And can you guess what happened? What happened when I dropped the pants? The goddamn sticker came out. And I picked it up, I'm in a rush, didn't know which pair of pants it was on. Remember, they looked the real. Similar, so I just slapped it on the path, walk up, bam, hook 
Cool. Ain't nothing wrong. I'm at the rest, you know, in the little line at Rose. And you know, they got the little, you know, it's fancy up there. They got the little lady, that Siri lady that call you up to the register now serving. Register five. So boom, that's me. I walk up. I ain't nervous. I ain't done nothing wrong. I just pick the stick up, put it on there. I get up there. Give it to the lady, how you doing, ma'am? She say, I'm fine, how you doing, sir? I say, I'm good. She look at the pants, you find everything okay? Yes, ma'am. <clears throat> Being real polite. <laughs> so she go along and Uh-oh, she the double bogey, so I'm all over the register, like, what happened? Why you, why you double bogey my pants? What happened with the pants? Let it come up, you know, trying to figure out. She happened to be one of the motherfuckers that really, really, really work at that goddamn job. She thinks she wrong. She thinks she one sale away from the system. Now, to bet you been here 10 years, still on register. Hey, you ain't moving up. You ain't got to take it so goddamn serious. She, where you get these pants from? So, this by the pants. Where you think I got them from? She said, mm, the price don't look right. She said, is it another pair of pants like this back there? I said, mm-mm, these the last pair. I said, it's another pair back there that's similar to this, but it ain't the same pair. She said, do you mind going back there and finding them? I said, yeah, yeah, that ain't my job. I said, listen, lady, you got two options. Either you can Ring me when you double boot me for the pants, bro. Or you can walk back there and look for the damn pants your damn self. You know what this is? Shut the whole register down. I'll be back. Pop the pants, walk back there. Now I got a lot of little people behind me mad as hell. Looking at me thinking I done done something. I'm looking at them like I ain't done nothing wrong, but I know one thing. She ain't going to find them pants. <laughs> It was one messy motherfucker like, why not? I said, shit, I put them pants back there by home decor in between <laughs> some rugs and a mirror, bitch, I... <laughs> She come back up there like 10 minutes later, huffing and puffing mad because she couldn't find the pants. I look at her like, is there a problem? She get the roll of her eyes, turn the register back on. Boo! That'll be $4.99. Ah! <laughs> bitch, I pulled out the $100 bill like he did. <laughs> get my change, bitch. <laughs>